Você.
got a goal. Let's go Dallas Stars. Dude, I, I want Dallas to win. I don't, I, I hate Vegas. I hate Vegas. So, go Dallas Stars, 100%. Wow! One one, ooh, one one for Fagus and Dallas Stars. Oh shisa, dude! The chat from the last stream is still there. <laughs> I think it's just still refresh. Welcome to part two. Three more hours to go. Oh Lord have mercy! <laughs> Please no overtime. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you so very much. If you decided to come back, I totally would understand if. Uh, if that's too much, oh, oh, hey, they're showing the game. Oh shit, they're showing the Dallas Stars. No, sorry, they're showing the Carolina game on my end. I guess we gotta watch some Carolina. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you, show match, show match. If you came back, it's this is the challenging stream. Yeah, the challenge, the nine o'clock stream till midnight. Oh shit. We can't take them golden cockroaches lightly. Bull crap ending to the Bruins game. It is what it is, Ronnie. Now you know how we, now you know how us Leafs fans felt for game one. Mmm, it sucks. It's not fun. It's not fun. <laughs> Don't worry, dude. Dude, Bruins will take game three. I'm feeling the Bruins will take that game three. They will probably take it 100%. Well, maybe not 100%. Maybe like 80%. We'll see. E stars, stars, stars. Uh, you know what? This is my new favorite site. I'm going to bookmark it on my tab. This is my new favorite site. Thanks to Cesar and Sexy Jerry for shouting it out. So right now it's 1 1 for the Stars and Vegas Golden Knights. Mm -hmm. We should have had a penalty shot. What? You think you should have had a penalty shot? Which when when in the game? Uh, what when in the game? Which period? Which player? I don't know. I'm not sure about a penalty shot, but uh. I love your dress. Oh, thanks. Austin Matthews is gonna be on your NHL highlight reel for sure. Off the map, you score number 70 in the... Well, actually, I don't know if you count... I don't know if you count playoff goals. I don't think you count playoff goals. But I guess it is his 70, 70, 70th goal this year. Only pay for what you need. Liberty, liberty, liberty. Liberty, liberty, liberty. Liberty, liberty, liberty. All right, we'll probably we'll see when this game probably be 15 minutes. When the clock was winding down, the high stick. Oh, like when the clock was winding. There was oh, there was a high stick. I don't think that's how penalty shot works. I think penalty shot usually is if like let's say a player's on a breakaway and then there's a like a deliberate trip. I think that's how power or penalty shots normally work. I know, Ronnie. I know. I know. It sucks. It's, it's not a good feeling when you're on the losing end. But don't worry. There's a reason why I said I think that series will go to Game Seven. There's a reason why I said that game is gonna go to Game Seven, cause. It's, f you know that saying, we may have lost the battle, but not the war. Looks like they're going to show me the Carolina game until the Edmonton game starts. I don't know. Carolina, oh damn, Carolina came back 3-2 to two right now. 3-2. But it hit zero, so it's good. Going to another hockey game? Yes, sir. Thank you, Hassan, for coming back. Obviously, as you can tell, the jersey I'm wearing, Edmonton Oilers. The Oilers and the LA Queens. I think these two I think these two teams actually faced each other in last year's playoffs. I think it was I think Edmonton Oilers. I don't know if it was last year or the year before, but welcome back, Metro. Dude, you know what time it is, Metro. You know what time it is. Shut up! Mm. Late night stream, late night. I 
said, I said, and I said. Welcome back, Metro. Thanks for coming back. Whew. Oh, damn, dude. Never done before. A double stream on a work night. Holy shit. I'm gonna hit my I'm gonna hit myself tomorrow. <laughs> oh, there it is. Vegas gets the first goal and then Dallas retaliated. Dallas Stars retal retal I can't say it. Retalerated? No, I'm saying it wrong. Hey, 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 hey. Is that Batman movie? Yes. Metro's intro? That's from the Batman. The, the most recent Batman movie where he goes to the club and uh, he just turned that shit up. Wow. And I said, wow. And I said, wow. Mmm, 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 mmm. Damn, Toronto. I'm sure Drake and Justin Bieber is happy. And the weekend. I'm sure all those guys are happy right now. They're Toronto's win. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yeah, I'm not sure. I guess. I think it's usually 15 minutes. So probably 9.15 is when the game will start. I said, whoa, I said, whoa, I said, whoa, I said, whoa. Great intro. All right. Three, about, uh, about four minutes left. Three, two Islanders. Carolina right now is one nothing in the series, so Islanders might tie it. Hopefully they switch to the Edmonton game, though, when that starts. Mm. Uh, 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 uh. Like a somebody. Ouch, 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 ouch. Ooh. Icing call. It's feeling good though. That Toronto game went by really, really quick for me. I don't know. I don't know about you guys, but that Toronto game flew by super quick for me. I doesn't. It doesn't feel like three hours. Uh, ooh, already 10 votes. Jeez. 50-50. 50% say Keynes are going to win. 50% says Edmonton is going to win. Oh, she Very, very divided. Very, very divided. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Hopefully my... Uh, yeah, I know. Pretty sure this game... Usually, oh, oh, puck, there you go, puck drop at 10, tw oh, or 9, 20. Let's go, LA Kings. That's my team, LA Kings, right? Okay, puck drop, puck is going to drop at 9, 20. Why, why, dude, why does it say the game is going to start at 9 o'clock, but then it's actually going to start at 9, 20? What's up with that? What's up with that? What kind of shenanigans is that? That's like almost a solid half an hour. You know, you know what that means too. That means that just means I'm gonna have to stay up later. God damn. Mm -mm. Carolina's gonna get a penalty, I think. Penalty. Boom, chum, boom, boom, chum, boom, boom, chicka, boom, boom, chicka, boom, boom, chicka, boom, boom. Adam, if you didn't know George R. R. Martin. Helped create the lore of Elden Ring. Uh, George R. R. Martin. He helped create the lore of Elden Ring. Okay, let me look him up. His name is... Oh, shit. Let me look him up. George... Maybe I've seen, maybe I've seen what he looked like. George R. R. Martin. Get this guy right here. Oh, okay. American novelist and screenwriter. 75 years old. Whatever project city you work on. Okay, so I okay, I see he he's a Oh he's is he the guy that wrote the Game of the Thrones book? I, is he is he the guy that wrote Game of Thrones books? Oh shit. Nice. The Winds of Winter, Fire and Blood. A Dance with Dragons. A dream. I'm just reading off some books he wrote. I did not know he did the Game of the Throne books. Oh shit! I did not know that. 
He's the Game of the Thrones. Nice. I didn't know. I, I didn't even. I, Game of Thrones, the book is also not that old. It's only 1996. Long time no see, Adam Lando. Welcome back, Lando. Hopefully, I don't hate myself tomorrow. <laughs> I'm reading a. Oh, I'm reading a. Fast for. Cr oh, you're reading that book. I uh, I don't know if you saw what Metro said, Landiano, but fun fact, in case you did not know, George R. R. Martin, the writer of Game of Thrones, he helped with the lore of the Elden Ring game. Did you know that, Lando? Oh, Ronnie, you're gonna call it all right dude don't worry it's appreciated i understand guys it is a late one so if you do have to go to bed 100 percent understand don't feel pressure to stay up this late edmonton or you know what maybe let's say if it's let's say i don't know maybe if it's like let's say if we get to the second intermission and it's like six nothing six nothing one of the teams or something like that maybe i'll call it early because obviously we know who's gonna win I remember hearing that somewhere. Mm. Yeah, I did not know that. I didn't know the Game of Thrones author helped with the Elden Ring, uh, Elden Ring game. Elden Ring. So the bosses, locations, and P N N P C S was. Oh, so he designed. I wonder if it's like, are you? Is there any bosses, Metro? Like any bosses or villains? Oh shit. Oh shit. Carolina just tied it in the last two minutes. Oh shit. So, so is there any creatures or bosses or villains or enemies that are similar to Game of Thrones? Like for example, in Game of Thrones, you know those ice pos ice pop Wow, I can't speak. What's that called in Game of Thrones? The ice people? The snow people? You know the feelings that they were amping up all Game of Thrones season just to be defeated in one episode? <laughs> I know that upset a lot of Game of Thrones fans. They, I know I was watching Game of Thrones of Landy, I know. And I know they were hyping those snow people. The undead or whatever they call them. They were hyping them up all series long. Just so they get defeated in one episode. <laughs> uh, Ed, did you change jerseys? Oh my god! What just happened? Carolina just stole this game. Like straight up 7 Eleven, BRB going to get some milk. Carolina just stole this game from the Islanders. No way. Islanders? Dude, seriously? Straight up island. No, sorry. Carolina. BRB going to get some milk. They straight up stole this game. Islanders blew it, bro. Islanders blew it. They were winning this game. And Carolina gets... Dude, Carolina did what Vancouver did last night. Just two goals out of nowhere. Back-to-back -back consistency within a matter of 20 seconds. Oh my god, Carolina just straight up stole that game. Dude, she's crying even. Wow, Islanders, you fucked up. Islanders, you f fucked up. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I would not I would not like I would not like to be a Islanders fan right now. Oh man. Drew called Drew McIntyre called Seamus fat on Raw. <laughs> nice. Dude, they have to poke. Dude, he He lost his ways. Dude, they have to they have to poke fun at they have to poke fun at him for gaining all that weight. Uh did you change shirts? Yeah, check out Rising Round stream. He has good energy like you. Aw, dude. Guys, rising round. Dude, NBA, any I know I know Metro's an NBA fan. Um Lakers stream being covered by the rising I mean I'm gonna go in there and say hello. Oh, that's uh, that's Moss Sports World. Rising Rhino. Rising Rhino. Let me get his link. The Rising Rhino. Doing doing Lakers. I got to do an NBA. I'm for sure going to do an NBA playoff game, just so you guys know. I don't know when I'm going to do it, but for sure I'm going to do NBA playoffs at some point. Okay, Rising Rhino stream right there. Let me go say hello. Show my respects. 
S O S someone save me. He's got the Lakers jersey too, bro. Islanders and shambles. Dude, holy fuck, Islanders almost scored on themselves. <laughs> I think that's it. I think that's gonna be it. Big bra. Carolina just stole this game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're fighting. Ah. They're fu Dude. Wow. Dude. It is not a good time to be a Islanders. Uh, Oh shit. You guys could probably hear him from my phone. <laughs> He's freaking out right now. <laughs> Dude. Sorry guys. I feel like I missed some comments. Uh, I am more a hockey guy. Yeah, fair enough. I am too, to be honest. But I'm definitely going to do basketball. I don't know when, but 100% going to do NBA at some point. Islanders salty as fuck by say by land. Oh yeah, dude, I'd be salty as too. Dude, this was the Islanders game. And then oh, I gotta watch this. Yeah, Carolina gets that. Yeah, <laughs> he's pissed on him. <laughs> Our goal got showed it on the Hurricanes in five. That's a solid prediction. I actually in my bracket challenge. I I know I said already. I put Dallas Stars as the winner, but I actually put Carolina as the up uh, as the finalists with them so dude my my prediction i think is pretty solid right now in my bracket challenge don't want to jinx it but cardinals walk off win wow it is not a good time to be an islanders fan it is seriously not a good time <laughs> oh man Oh, and yeah, number 29 just cannot resist his emotions. Number 21, salty as fuck. Oh, just lost a fight. I think it's just going to be. Is there a fight yet? Wow. <laughs> I can't help the laugh. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, I fixed the sound. Oh, you fixed the sound. Man, they're embarrassing themselves now. Yeah, now they're just, yeah. Dude, just take the loss. Like, just take the loss. Move on real lives. Nope, nope, nope. They're fighting. They're fighting. Just take the loss and move on. That's going to haunt them. Let's say, for example, it's like a... Oh, yeah, this one Islanders guy cannot resist. Number 17. Oh, and he lost the fight, like you said. He got John Cena on the ice. Wow. Number 17, he's pissed. Oh, two guys are two guys just got uh, ejected. Oh boy. Just Washington Moss Sports Warden Rhino 42 set hike. Let's go, baby. Everybody's streaming right now. Let's go. Streaming night. Big streaming night for a lot of people. Wow. Oh, this guy just got ejected. Bye bye, Martin. Number 17 Islanders. Bye bye. <laughs> one by one. I mean, I'd be pissed too, but goddamn. Moss World's Tour. Now, I don't know who they get pissed at. Are they, are they going to get pissed at the goalie? The goalie, what the fuck, bro? Oh, yeah, that's another thing. I would hate to be the goalie right now for the Islanders. Oh, my God. I just, I would skate off the rink and cry. Skate off the rink. I don't care. Switch out goalies. I don't care. Okay, it's 9.20. This is the time that Edmonton puck is... Dude, what the bullshit? Why am I seeing this game? That bullshit. Why am I seeing... Dude, I'm missing the Edmonton game. What the fuck? Let me refresh the stream. There we go. All right. Now it's time to watch the game that the stream is... All right, let's go. It's loading. Exact time 
Alrighty. And the ten Oilers. Mmm, stars gotta go. Dude, I'm rooting for the stars. I don't like Vegas. Seriously, don't like Vegas. I would choose the stars over Vegas any day. All right, Edmonton Oilers, LA Kings. Okay, I only missed the first 30 seconds. That's okay. But here we go. Uh, Edmonton Oilers. Okay, Edmonton Oilers is ta is hosting game one. Game one and game two. So that means Edmonton um, is obviously, well, LA Kings is the underdog in this series. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Another fight. Another fight for that game. <laughs> Damn, they're salty as fuck. Edmonton Oilers. Dreisaitl, the German Dodge. Mm. Oh, yeah. Dreisaitl and uh, McDavid are on this team. Forgot. Oh, a lot of big hits already in this game. This game is physical. The physicality in this game is already top notch. I uh, just gave a shout out to Detroit. Uh, they just give the shout out to Detroit Lions. Nice. <laughs> Go Detroit Lions. Wow, dude. Edmonton is super physical so far. Edmonton really wants this victory. Looks like it. Alrighty. Alrighty, all right, all right, all right. Long night tonight. Long night. Face off in Edmonton zone. Elkins shoots it. Safe by the goalie. Dude, too bad Mike Mike isn't here anymore. Remember earlier in the NHL season how much shit Mike was talking about his te his team? <laughs> Look at where they are now in the playoffs. <laughs> Super poetic. Dallas scores two one. Nice. Nice. Although, I mean, I'm rooting for Dallas Stars, don't get me wrong. But if the Jets win their game or series, that's who we got to face next. I don't want to face Vegas again, dude. I don't want to, I do not want to go through that a third time. The Edmonton crowd is chaunting one of the players, number 22. Adam says, oh, that's right. It'd be me for Cesar. Cesar would probably win too, to be honest. Cesar would probably win. I'm not, I'm, dude, I said it. I'll say it again. My bracket challenge, I put Dallas, Cow Dallas Cowboys, Dallas Stars as the winners of the Stanley Cup. Man, what a treat it is to watch. What is it? Man, what a treat it is to watch playoff hockey literally all night. Hell yeah. Dude, hockey playoff is just different for me. Like, regular, like regular season hockey is fun, but playoff is just it's a different atmosphere. It's because you know the stakes are high. It's just different. Look, even sometimes hockey regular season can be boring for me, but playoff hockey is just a different. Like, that's probably why... I could get through double streams for it because it's just a different atmosphere. I would never do this on a regular season hockey double night like this. But because it's playoff, it's like a different five different atmosphere. It's more fun. It, it's easier to get through it, you know, if that, if that makes sense. I haven't moved my from my couch in hours. Damn, bro. Thank you so much for staying here this whole time, Jerry. Dude, this might be the first time in a hot while where you're you're here for a while, which thank you so much for. But uh, dude, I hope you're having a great night. I'm happy to hear you're having a great night. And yep, Edmonton Oilers, LA Queens, shot by Edmonton. <gasps> Ooh, he's doing the butterfly. LA Kings, go LA Kings goalie is doing the butterfly. Golden Knox, fuck! Damn it! That's another thing too. When this game goes to halftime, I will check in the Dallas game. I'll make sure to do that. Uh, yeah, the last couple of weeks was hectic for me. I'm nice, bro. And you know, dude. Just so you know, 
you're totally fine. I totally understand, dude. And I always say my streams always prioritize life before my streams. Always. But I'm happy to hear you finally can breathe air again, if you know what I mean. You can take a, you can just relax and have time for yourself. And I really appreciate that you choosing that time to spend time here in my in our streams. It really means a lot. But you know you're more than welcome if you have to do other things. You're more than welcome to just, you know, dip out if you have to. You know you're fine by me. All right. Battling behind the LA Kings goalie. Mm. Nice deke by Edmonton. Slap shots it. <gasps> Edmonton should have scored, bro. How did they not score? Edmonton sh should have gotten their first goal just now, but they suck balls. Oh, oh, dude, I can't watch that replay. I seriously cannot watch that replay. I die a little inside when I see that replay. Mmm, Stars. Damn, dude, that, that game, that Dallas Stars game sounds very action-packed. Losing, but let's go. Let's go, baby. That Carolina game is going to make me laugh tonight. Oh, that's going to... They're going to get roasted for that for sure, the Islanders. They're going to get roasted for sure tonight by the NHL League. Kings now dump the puck down. Drysdale dumps it down. Mm. Mm. Stars, Dallas Stars, someone save me. Oi, 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 oi. Damn, Cesar, you hear that? Sounds like Mexican music. Yep, 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 yep. Face off in M uh, Edmonton zone. Edmonton wins the puck. Gets it out of there. <gasps> nice save by the Edmonton goalie. L.A. Keynes now applying the pressure in the Edmonton zone. Around the net. Oh, shit. Tic-tac-toe. Oh, L.A. Keynes. Uh-oh. <gasps> Mm. This is the net. Oh, go Edmonton. Break away. Oh, my God. No fucking way, bro. Dude, I would scream if I could. He just did a... I don't know. I don't know what you call that kind of deke, but he did the freaking puck between the legs deke. And if that was a goal, bro, that might that would have been goal of the night. Right there. That was some McDavid shit right there. Edmonton now back on the offense. LA Kings get it. All right, Edmonton gets the puck, dumps it down to the left-hand wing. LA, though, back on the Edmonton soul, applying the pressure. Backhand saved by the goalie, Skinner. End of the first Dallas Stars game has ended. Okay, this is perfect timing, Cesar, because once this game goes into intermission, then the Dallas game should probably be back on, so... That would be my, uh, once this game is an intermission, that would be my alternate game. Dallas Stars and the LA Kings. LA Kings. <laughs> Golden Knights, I mean. <laughs> yeah. It's getting late. It's getting late. I'm going to start to stutter more. My words are going to be fumbling more. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Uh, playoff McDavid has arrived. Uh-oh. 
Uh-oh. Playoff McDavid has arrived. Let's see his beautiful face. Where is that? Where is that McDavid? I haven't seen him yet. Uh, 13.30. Oh, off the mask. Or shoulder of uh, Skinner. We established that the Edmonton goalie sucks, right? All right, here comes at him. McDavid. Oh, my God, he did it. Oh, my God. Mm, that's why they pay him the big bucks. That's why they pay him the big bucks. Did he do that back spinorama? He did a back rama Dude, he did a back rama Dude, he did a freaking back rama He did a fucking back rama Good night, everyone. No, Metro! Why? No, it's all good, dude. If you gotta go, you gotta go. Damn, dude, McDavid doing the back of Rama. Back of freaking Rama. I was gonna say spin Rama, but I think that was more of a back of Rama. All right. All right, one nothing. Sheesh. Dude, you know what? Yeah, LA Lakers and LA Kings at the same time. So wait a minute. How does that work? I don't know if they share the same arena or not, but, or maybe they're playing in the other place. Maybe they're playing at the other place. Oh. Yeah, McDavid gets the assist. Oh my God. That's gonna be on your feet tonight. Oh my God, oh my God. Son of a gun. As we say hello and welcome everybody in with the two-time national champion from Oklahoma, Aaron Oklahoma. Matisson, I'm Tiffany Green. And when you think about these Florida Gators, one of the best scoring offenses in the country, top five, and that was on full display in game one. 17 runs scored yesterday between these two ball clubs. The difference came in the circle. South Carolina's pitching staff giving up 10 walks and three hit by pitches. And Florida taking the opportunity. Where are these people? Took full advantage. Oh, Nine this is uh, an MLB baseball. Their damage early. No, that's Dyson not an MLB. Erickson that's like high school Passing baseball. The bat, though, very contagious for the Gators as they. The Gators. Registered 11 runs to the what is this? Three innings. How about that bases clearing double from Corby Otis and the Gators were absolutely rolling. It's unbelievable what they did at the plate, both of these teams. You know they're going to fight till the very last pitch. Offensive production from both of these teams. And again, it was in the what circle kind of league South is that? Carolina. We finally see Vodder step in for the Gamecocks and the freshman Ava Brown getting the start for the Gators. Incoming design. Oh, you think about Ava Cesar, Brown don't tease me. Don't tease me, Cesar. Don't they freaking tease me. I'm ready. My body's ready. My body is ready. With 14 wins My body the is ready. What makes her so deadly is the fact that she can throw three speeds. She's going to utilize the defense. You're going to see balls in the air. She can elevate. <laughs> Did you just hear that? You're going to see just balls in the air. Early in her You're going to see balls season. in the air. And when you look at this, South Carolina oh, you son of a gun, Cesar. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. My body is ready. Winnipeg Boy Blue Tex. Ooh, Winnipeg Boy Blue. 
batting seventh mm. this afternoon. Winnipeg Something boy blue. Talked about with this South Carolina team. Winnipeg she boy says, blue. Still haven't felt like we've played Pretty nice. Our best softball, and she's really hoping that Wait a minute, this is not right. Why did I did it switch stations on me? This is a no no dude, it's showing baseball. What the f God damn it, Stream East. You're scaring me. Uh, the font keep changing when uh the font keep changing when I convert the PNG. Oh, okay. I could help with that too if it's giving you issues with so the PNG. Therefore, I eventually had to switch to. Oh, okay, switch to that font, Arial, the Arial font. Gotcha, gotcha. Mm. Oops, sorry. Oh, LA! Damn, they raced for that puck and they both fell together. Hold hands. Bow, 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 bow. All right. Toe and 24. Green Day. SOS equals Sigma. Omicron. Uh, mm. Uh, mm, oh, no way. Another goal. Ooh, <laughs> unreal shot. All right, let's see this. Unreal shot inbound. Dude, a lot of people were saying Edmonton would be the Canadian team to take it all away. Maybe we're going to find out. Oh, I thought that was going to be the goal right there. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude. I think they were, no, don't want to get cocky. Don't want to get cocky. Boom, baby. Oilers definitely out skilled the Keens. Yeah. Yeah. I think, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think last year this was the same thing. Oilers versus Keens in the first round or something like that. And I think I think the last time these two faced in the playoffs, it was a sweat by the Edmonton Oilers. This series relies heavily on if Dubai shows up. Oh, Dubai is... This series relies heavily on if Tobias shows up or not, or plays or not. Is Tobias supposed to be the? Is he? Is he kind of like supposed to be the star player of the LA Kings? LA Kings, I think, like the Washington Capitals. I think they barely made it in. Like they made it in very last minute. So, yeah. Probably gonna be if there's gonna be a sweep, it's obviously gonna be the Rangers and probably maybe the Edmonton Oilers. Maybe. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Uh, Dubai was traded. For and paid eight years, eight point five million, eight point five per year. He's supposed to be a star player, but plays so lazy. He's useless sometimes. Bad move by them. Yeah, All right, I'm not complaining. He's the he was on the Jets too. He's he was on the Jets. What action for Monday night? 
Yeah, dude. Great night for hockey. Boston. Uh, on the, uh, Boston. Dude, great night for hockey. Obviously, I'm missing out on Dallas Stars match. And uh, Carol, dude, Carolina. <laughs> that ending, though. Jets got lucky on that trade. Yeah. It was a win, too. Like, it, it wasn't just getting rid of Dubias, but they got good shit in return. Like, dude, LA Kings lost that one. Great sports night. Hell yeah. Speaking of him, he just took a penalty. Did he actually? I'm going to see it right now. There he is, Dubois. <laughs> Dubois. Come on. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, the crowd is yelling. Yeah. Dubois. Is it going to be Dubois? Best Monday night in a long time, dude. I'm so happy. Dude, if, if we, Team SOS, contribute in some way of making this the best Monday night, thank you so much. Appreciate you. Love you. Uh, yeah, the Jets got two really solid players and two good draft picks. Very good trade. Are penalties necessary at times? I guess so, yeah. If the player, or if the player takes the stick and whacks him, him in the face, hell yeah. Penalty be very, very necessary. Fed and fed it, fed and necessary. But we'll see if if we get to the second intermission and it's like freaking I don't know, four nothing Edmonton. I think it's safe to say Edmonton will probably win it, and then maybe I might call it just you know for obvious reasons. Like, can a team benefit from coming? Oh, can a team benefit from committing? No, I don't see. I don't see how it benefits because obviously you're down. Like you, you get a penalty. You're short a player. I mean, there's been many times in hockey's where teams get short-handed goals, but probably because the other team was playing like a bunch of douchebags. <laughs> but no, uh, tactical wise, I don't see it. Being down short, and I mean, I don't know if Jerry wants to put any input on that, but I don't see how uh, being short a person, there's a secret tactic behind that that maybe gives the, I don't know, the other team an upper hand. But who knows? But don't don't see, don't see how that could be a tactic. Tactic wise, don't see it how. That's kind of like saying I don't know in the NFL, there's a benefit getting a flag and then you go back how is how does it work in the nfl you go back 10 yards or a few yards or it repeats the down that's how i kind of look at it input on what so cesar was asking a question he cesar said um are penalties necessary at times tactical wise and I just kind of said, I don't see how it could be. Sometimes in soccer, they say red card are helpful. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, the only maybe scenario I can think of is maybe, let's say, a player is on a breakaway. And let's say that particular player is known to score a lot. Maybe the opposing player might trip him up. And I don't know. Maybe that's the only way I can maybe think of it. Slap shot saved by L.A. But yeah, I don't. Being short, being short a player, is very not good. How is a red car helpful? That's a good question. Yes. How is Cesar? Are you able to help us understand that? Not really a tactic. Maybe if it prevents a goal. Mm -hmm. Red car, you lose a player for a game. Yeah, I'm actually very interested now, Cesar. If you happen to know the answer. How can getting a red card potentially be helpful? What's the twist or tactic twist on that one? Because, yeah, you lose a player for the rest of the game. Saved by LA Kings. And now we're going to get a bit of a scrap. Oh, oh, let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor. Make some noise. Oh, that almost went in. Damn. <laughs> the goalie, Talbot is the goalie for the uh, LA Kings, in case anybody was wondering. He, like, punched a puck. Like, he punched scrap or whatever you want to call it. Yeah, he looks really good. But again, you look at this power play. Just the, the personnel they have out there. Look at the guys on 
I could I could see a breakaway take the red car. Oh, maybe. Oh, okay, pretty much. Maybe they take out the player because they can't uh, they can't perform at high speed. So yeah, maybe that's the only way I can maybe think of it. Let's say like Connor McDavid is on a breakaway and he's known to score. Maybe the player may just trip him up, sacrifice a penalty for that. Because, like I said, maybe McDavid is normally known to score. So they would just rather risk taking that penalty than get a chance for him, you know. Good, good dude. Uh, God, dude, McDavid is so good. Oh, dude. That's why they pay him. He deserves a cup. That's why they pay him the big bucks. I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna witness here in a few seconds what just unfilled. Well, that was all. Oh my God! Oh my McDavid, chill the fuck out. And that man just walks right through them. McDavid just like walks right through the whole team. Disgusting, freaking disgusting. Just walks through the whole team. <laughs> yeah. This right, oh my god, that's disgusting, dude. McDavid got woman in the crowd tonight. <laughs> oh, he, oh, yeah, every girl wants to be with him for sure. Playing like that, dude, you know it, you freaking know it. Edmonton's got 50, still a power play, 15 seconds left, shoots it, misses the net. Grabbed by the LA goalie. In hockey, it's different. Only two minute penalties most. In soccer, you lose a player to have. Yeah. So, yeah, obviously in hockey, a minor penalty is two minutes. Major penalty is five minutes. Soccer, I mean, I guess when you get a yellow card, you don't. I think Cesar said, when you get a yellow card, you don't play the next game, I think that's what it is. Dubai is taking stupid penalties, honestly, dude. Landiano, we were just talking about Tobias and that uh, Winnipeg Jets trade. I, um, was it last year or the year before? Ooh. I'm still meh. Yes, you are. But yeah, dude. We were talking about a little bit earlier, me and Jerry, how Dubaya, Dubias? Jets won that one. Hell yeah, they won that trade big time. Apparently, Dubias getting, is getting paid $8 million per season for the next eight years. So he's supposed to be an all-star player, but according to Jerry, he's actually, he could come off as very lazy at times. And as you said, he's probably drawing stupid penalties. Oh, Oilers. And dude, of course, McDavid is playing really good tonight. He did like a back arama spin arama at one point. I could see this series being a sweep. <laughs> this series and Ranger series are probably the two series. If there was going to be a sweep, it'd be these two series, Rangers and Edmonton. I have an idea for the cup finals. We could make the overlay silver. Oh, for like these teams up here? Oilers aren't giving them. Yeah, Oilers are showing them no mercy. Dude, the McDavid, the McDavid is... Pissed. He's pissed, dude. He's freaking pissed. He always looks pissed, too. But yeah, for sure, when the finals start, we can think of something. Mm. Oilers are showing no mercy. I like it. I like it. Show them no mercy. Remember, remember. Remember, no Russian. That's the Oilers tonight to the uh, LA Kings. Imagine if I had a jar full of Chaozo and Salmine. Mm, yeah. Mm, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, Golden Cox. Damn it. No, Cesar. No. Dude, I'll play it just for you. Thank you.
Yeah, we will switch to that game too, by the way. Once this game goes into halftime, which is in four and a half minutes, we will switch to the uh, Dallas game. Because I think it's that game. I think, yeah, it's just that, that's the other game going on right now, I think. Oh. Jumps it now. I hope for an Avalanche Jets like ending. Mm. Avalanche and Jets like ending. Yeah. It's gonna be it, it's gonna be an exciting series. I'm gonna be brutally honest. I'm feeling Avalanches. I'm really feeling that they're gonna win tomorrow. I don't wanna say it. Inter Miami won the Coppa. It, uh, Italy? Yeah. left or wow two minutes two fifty three minutes left all right uh oh getting there starting i'm getting there It's still two full periods to go. <laughs> Edmonton earlier is racing for the puck. Thumps it back. Uh, oh, excuse me. Jen Heller. To the ball. Freaking to ball. He sucks balls, dude. You know what the worst part too is the person that we gave up for the ball was Patrick Line. That's the worst part. I hope we, I hope he returns to Winnipeg. No, do not give us back Dubois. Hell no. Oh, they could keep Dubois. They're stuck, dude. I think Dubois. Yeah, no, like Jerry said earlier, it was an eight-year contract, so they're screwed. Oh, you meant Line A. Oh, yeah. I mean, I like Line A. I mean, I'm not sure why we. I mean, there was a lot of rumors that he. Uh, from what I heard one time was he wasn't getting along with like not not like in a bad way but like Lining needs a reset yeah I've heard some rumors that he wasn't getting a, well, I don't want to say he wasn't getting along but from what I heard was he wasn't really happy with Shifley and Blake Wheeler at the time because he wanted to be I don't know I don't know. I have no idea if I'm right. There was rumors that he wasn't getting along with uh, Shifley and Mueller at the time. He wanted the puck more and get more shots on net, I guess. But maybe he felt like Shifley and Mueller 
weren't really giving him the puck a lot. I'm not sure. Something along those lines. It, it's only rumored. It's not official, but I think there's something in the back there. I, I like, you know, something going on in the back, I heard. For Mother's Day, I would like to give my mom one of my designs in the aqua color. Aw, nice. Yeah, you should, dude. You should make a, you should make a design or something. Or may, I don't know, maybe do a design on stream elements, and, like make a shirt for stream elements, and then maybe just order one for yourself and give it to your mom or something. Not, you know, a lot of options you could do there. Oh, you did? Nice. That's amazing, dude. Esco, give it in. Esco, give it in the Esco, give it in the Esco, give it in the. All right, less than one minute. I have mom and dad to sign. Oh, that's amazing. It's amazing. Uh oh. Oilers, I think, just got their first penalty of the game, I want to say. Uh oh. Yeah. That was a bad penalty. Not sure if that was deliberate, but oh yeah, that's dangerous. That skate is he, that skate's going in the midair. Last minute, or Kopitar. Dad too. Mm. Uh Adam pronunciation test. Oh god, at this time. Like crazy. Right, I'm gonna switch to the Dallas game. I'm gonna switch to the Dallas Stars game. Uh because yeah, I'm pretty sure yeah, this it's saying zero, so I know that there's going to be no goals or nothing. Switching to the Dallas Stars game right now. Oh, no. 4-2? Really? Really? 4-2 Vegas? Dallas, I had a... No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Still a lot of time, a lot of hockey time, a lot of time. 4-2, yeah, right now it's 4-2 Vegas. Alec Perchinko and Ivan Barbavosvi are former Blues on the Vegas Golden Knights. You know what? I might have said the first name right. Alec Perchinko and Ivan Barbavosvi. Yeah, the, last, the other game. You know what? I might have said that name right, Perchinko. I might have said something right for once, actually. Dallas, 4-2 of 13 or so minutes left. Ooh, Desmond Wapass. Desmond Wapass. How's it going, Desmond Wapass? Hope you're doing great. Hope your night is going great. Thank you so much for coming out this freaking late. Hope life is good. Hope you're doing great. Are you Oilers or LA Kings? Thank you so much for coming out. Hope life is good. Hope things are great. Hope your Monday was good. Hope your weekend was great. Rick likes to change his proof. Yeah. Damn. How's Winnipeg this late, by the way? I'm so Dude, you're saying that he's also saying the same thing. How is Winnipeg this late night, by the way? I'm so mad. The same thing every time. Every time the same thing. How is Winnipeg this evening, by the way? And I'm so mad. Dude, I have a I have a muscle memory at this point. How's Winnipeg this late night? By the way, I'm so mad. Oh, Rick is a robot. <laughs> he is a robot. Is this you, Rick? Oh, he does have a video. But I understand. 
I'm always man. JK. Rick, do you like the Oilers and do you like Andrew Tate? <laughs> there you go. Follow dude, follow the Andrew Tate. He will help you out. He'd probably be brutally honest though. Nah, just joking. Alright. Okay, we are in the intermission of the Oilers, so in the meantime I'll watch Dallas Stars. And right now I miss my son since I sent him to live with my girlfriend's brother because of numb nut. You know what? I'm sure that you know, maybe that's a good call. Well, if you know what I mean, make sure there's no interaction whatsoever with that person and your son. That's you know what it sucks, but that's a good call. If that is to prevent them seeing each other, then thing is he found me first yeah don't worry somebody pointed that out and i'm like he found cesar first so it's probably you know eh. i am very sorry i've always been keep saying the same damn thing every time no that's okay that's dude i can't speak for anybody else but i have the patience for that i'm always happy to listen but and like i said i can't speak for anybody else but you if you got a fan i understand but like me and Cesar has been, we been trying to tell you, my friend, hey, nothing is going to happen. Nothing is going to get resolved unless you take action. So, but yeah, I'll be honest. A lot of people don't have that kind of patience, especially if you say the same thing again and again and again. I understand why you're saying the same thing again and again and again. I personally, myself, been in that kind of position. But, and like I said, I will listen, I will listen, I'll continue to listen. I can't speak for anybody else. You know, other people, everybody has their limitations. I can respect that and honor that. But once again, Rick, I will listen. I will say my things. Cesar will say his things. But it ultimately is going to break down to, Rick, you got to do something about it. I understand, Rick, but you got to do something about it. I, it's unfortunate to hear that, Rick. But you got to do something about it. <laughs> As Jerry's in a good mood. How will that slide? Nah, it's all good. I'm happy to hear you're in a good mood, by the way, too, Jerry. And then I can't let it go either. I'm upset about the whole thing also. Dude. From what you said two streams ago, you said a very sensitive word that your son is feeling. Trust me, my friend. You bring that up to something, child support services or the law. Nah, fam. That's going to take action right away. Oh, for sure it breaks your heart. Dude, you go to guidance counselor, child support services, and you bring up the S word. My son has been feeling the S word because of this individual. A full grown adult making a minor feel the S word. Trust me, my friend. They're gonna be on that like like that. Believe me, dude. Don't matter what your dad say. Don't matter what your sister says. Don't matter what you say, <laughs> dude. The moment that topic is brought up to the table, it's gonna be looked at right away. But, like I said, Rick, you gotta do something about it, dude. That goes to anybody in life. Even I had to learn this. I have to learn this, and I still might struggle with this, but unless you don't say anything or don't do anything, nothing is going to change. Nothing's going to happen. Almost, mm, Yeah, and I'm not made him feel the way because of some, yep. I feel like you have a very genuine, kind heart, Rick. You're a very genuine, kind person. And, you know, if there's one thing we have in common, I think we've been walked over at some point in our lives. But man, I don't think I'm. I don't. I don't think I could be that nice if I had a son and that was going on, dude. I don't think. I think a very different side of me will awake. Oh, saved by Golden Knights. You can hear the players swear. Yeah, I've heard it a few times in the scrum. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Dude. Trust me, you talk to Uncle Stunner if he's ever here, he, he will let you know. Anything in anything, a case with a minor and an adult, 
it will be taken care of. That first shot is actually blocked by McNabb. It's Ben with the second one. I hate the NHL rankings. Dallas should not have to play Vegas. It should be 1-8 like old times. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. And Dallas just had a power play. Unfortunately, good penalty kill for the Vegas Golden Knights. Rick, please do yourself a favor. Rick, please do your, yourself and kids a favor and please get a report field. Yeah, dude. Do it. And the thing is, I had absolutely no idea he was getting treated. You know what, Rick? If I may say, and this might hurt, but the more you don't do anything about it, it's going to start to be on you a little bit. It was going to be Dallas versus LA and then Vegas lost and the Kings won. Oh, so a very last, a very last minute, it got swapped. Very last minute swap. Mm, very last minute swap. The Stanley Cup playoffs continue tomorrow night. The Capitals take on the Rangers at seven Eastern, four Pacific. Followed by the Avalanche. Ba 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 ba. the Lightning and the Panthers game two of that series at seven thirty Eastern. The timing's tomorrow for hockey is so weird. Jets is at 8.30 and then Canucks is at 9. I don't want to hear that you can do it because of your dad. Again, you got to stop burning. Dude, like, no offense. Your dad's got dementia. He's not going to remember the next day. He, no. I don't think I should do a fire report. You're telling me that a never full grown adult is making your son feeling suicidal and you should not do a fire report? I'm not sure about that. Yep, dude. Jerry, see, I think Jerry's patience is starting to run thin a little bit. A little bit. I don't want to hear you. No excuses anymore. Do something. Yep, Jerry, I think Jerry's going to start to show. Mm. Do you like the Oilers? Yeah, yeah. They're not my favorite team, but they're, you know, they're the next team I'll watch, right? No excuses. Do something. Yep. Gotta do something, dude. Dude, if you need help, find someone. Find a brother. Find guidance counselor. I get it, dude. You have a genuine heart. I have a genuine heart, too. Sometimes I get walked over. Sometimes I got to find someone that's a bit more voice of the voiceless. Dude. Got to do something. Dude. And that might be brought up if it finally gets a serious case. That might They might ask you that. Why didn't you do anything? Mm-hmm. Like I said, I have the patience. Don't know about others. Trust me. You bring up... No, I... I, dude, I tried. Like, do you want me to fly down there and hold your hand and do it? <laughs> no, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. If I want me to, I'll fly down there and hold your hand and do it with you. Dude, I'm not going to believe for a freaking second... That there's no solution. When you're with Amex Platinum, Dude, some people would murder. Some people would seriously murder if that if that was somebody else. Four two Vegas. Boo. Okay, it's only game one. Dallas could lose this one. No worries. No panic button just quite yet. Two nothing Edmonton. Okay. Ooh, Robert Robertson. Robertson. I don't know, not, 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 I'm loving it. Face off in the halfway zone. Okay, I'm starting to feel tired a little bit. Don't know if I'm going to finish this game. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to finish this Edmonton game. <laughs> we'll see. I got, you know, I, oh, Rose, you're back. Rose, I wasn't sure if you were going to come back. Dude, I got to do it for you, Rose. I got to do it for you, my friend. Rose, R Rose.
Rose, I know, I know you hate me. I know, Rose, I'm sorry, Rose, I'm sorry, I know. I'm sorry. Rose, would it make you feel better if I put on the Calgary jersey? Would that make you feel better? Just give me the word. If that would make you feel better, Rose, just give me the word, and I'll do it for you. <gasps> oh, covers up Vegas Golden Knight. But thank you for coming back, Rose. I wasn't sure if you were out for the night. It is late. Holy crap, it's late. But Rose, if you want, me, if it makes you feel better, you want me to put on the Flames jersey? I gotta hear it from the Rose. I gotta hear it from the Rose. If you want me to put on the Flames jersey, I gotta get the seal. Of, I gotta get the seal of approval from my tribal chief, Rose. But if Rose doesn't say anything, then the Edmonton's got to stay on. Put on the Jets jersey. I like their, yeah. Oh, yeah, the Jets jersey. Yes? Oh, oh Rose? I'm, I, you're lucky I like you. Because new viewers are going to come in here and be like, look at this salty Flames fan. But, Rose, I'll do it just for you. All right. I'll do it just for you, Rose. Even though it's gonna look goofy as fuck. All right, Rose, just for you. Just for you, Rose. Just for you. I did it. I did it. Dude, Calgary Flames jersey. I did it just for you, Rose. Just for you, my friend. Just for you. <laughs> but now, <laughs> but now, watch if a new person comes in. They're gonna be like, "Look at this salty flames fan." <laughs> no, you know what? It's actually funny. I th thank you. You literally made, dude. If this seriously made your day, I'm happy. <laughs> Man, I know <knows> you. <laughs> hey, 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 you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe it it'd be funny. If a new person comes in, maybe it'll be hilarious to see an Edmonton stream. Take that garbage off! <laughs> oh, Rose. All right, Rose. I think I think you're getting no better here. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sorry, Rose. I think the people have spoken. Sorry, Rose. You're kind of out. I'll bid it right now. <laughs> Winnipeg Jets time. Pickles, no. <laughs> Dude, make the playoffs. Take that didn't last long. <laughs> Sorry, Rose. You're you're outbidded, my friend. You're outbidded by the by the people. <laughs> Sorry, Rose. I'm tired and cranky. <laughs> Dude, I'll put a I'll put an Ottawa Senators jersey on to really. <laughs> it's all good. Adam should collect every jersey. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Pickles. Thank you so much for... Dude, Pickles, you're still up? What? Thank you so much, dude. You know what? Fuck it. I'm doing it. You know what I'm about to do. You know what I'm about to do. God damn it. You know what I'm about to do. You know what I'm about to do. I don't care if it's 1030. You know what time it is. You know what time it is. I'm cranky at someone right now, too. It's probably me. <laughs> it's probably me. <laughs> oh, Dallas is losing. Yeah, dude. Dude, they're fucking up my bracket challenge. I put Dallas. Dude, I put Dallas to win the cup. What the fuck is this? All right. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Okay. That's it. I got my daily. Well, I did it before, but it's a new stream. So if you weren't here before, you would have missed it. So got my daily dose of the pickles. Pickles. You know what? Just because you're out this late, pickles, I play your intro. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four. Open the door. Open the door. You want to know the date of this, by the way? 
the date of this pickle jar. Mm, February 2024. That's good, right? Pickles don't expire usually, I don't think. I can't imagine the back washing that pickle jar. <laughs> yep. Uh, I thought you were switching jerseys again when I... Wa no, dude, you know me. Dude, dude, I switch it all the time. I switch it all the time. You win Orange Oilers when you get to Knoxville. Dude, I'm a bag wagon fan. Dude, I got pickles from like 2019 and I still eat them. Okay, good. So pickles... Because I don't... Pickles, do they expire or no? Maybe they don't expire. I don't know. Oh, fuck. I dropped my... Drink. Okay, it's empty. Phew. Oh, I dropped my... I dropped my cup. Good thing. I thought... Okay, it's empty. Phew. Vegas told ya. Dude, I fucking put... On my bracket challenge, I put Dallas to win. This is terrible. My bracket challenge is fucked now. <laughs> oh. Just watch the top of the jar. All right. Adam is pickled. I don't think pickles expire. Oh. Uh, fucking Dallas scored already. Oh, yeah. Dude, Rose, I'm watching your team, by the way. Dallas Stars. I'm watching your team. But actually, I'm going to switch now because I think the Oilers game is about to start. Uh, sorry, sorry. Go ahead, back to the McDavid's been playing really good, by the way. McDavid, McDavid actually showed up to this playoffs. He's scary right now. Welcome back, by the way, Moss. Sorry, I didn't say hello. Welcome back. Thank you for coming out this late. Thank you for everybody coming out this late. I understand it's a work or a school night. And just so you know, don't feel pressure to stay out this late too. I don't know if I'm gonna finish this game. Might just do the second period and maybe call it. I'm pretty sure Edmonton's gonna win this. Fucking Dallas scored. Dallas, Dallas, Dallas scored already. Mm. All right, let's go, baby. Let's go. LA Kings suck. LA Kings suck. Uh, stupid Oilers, you suck. Yeah. The team that made the playoffs suck. Yeah. The teams that made the playoffs suck. <laughs> first halfway end. Uh, first halfway end. Why are the why are in the Oilers jerseys? First halfway end. Uh, oh, first halftime you meant? Yeah, first halftime just ended. Second period just started. Why are in the Oilers? Why am I in the Oilers jersey? Because that's the team that's playing, my friend. The New York Islanders had more game misconducts than shots on the goal in the third. Dude, if you guys don't know, Carolina and Islanders game, hilarious ending. If you don't know, Islanders were winning. They were winning. They were winning. And then how did that happen? Two back-to-back -back goals in the very, very last second. Dude, I would not want to be an Oil or Islanders fan today. Not a good day to be an Islanders fan. Oilers suck doo-doo. I mean, it is orange. It could be a turd. Should be in the Jets jersey. Tomorrow, my friend. Tomorrow, I will be in the Jets jersey. I promise. I pretty, pretty promise. Connor, Mike, David. <laughs> Dude, I gotta say it. I'm gonna say it again. You remember at the beginning of the NHL season how official Mike Mike would not shut up about how much he hates the Oilers, how they suck, this and that. And look, at they're in the playoffs now. <laughs> it's helpful. Uh, we're winning 3 nothing, lost 5-3. Mmm. Mmm. Should be in the Calgary jersey. Yeah, make the playoffs. Dude, if it was Calgary, I'd be wearing the Calgary jersey. Oh, Ramstein. Such depth, and one thing we haven't talked a lot about, but 
I'm honestly prefer the current jersey. I I honestly prefer the current jersey than the 2007 jersey. For which team, says I? For this Edmonton or Dallas or which team? That's where this team is built up and down all four lines. They were middle of the pack in goal scoring Do hospital. The Flames jersey. Oh. So you prefer the current, the current Flames jersey? Uh, like this one. Okay, let's take a look. CB, this is the 2007 jersey. Okay, that's the 2000. I'm honestly with the current jersey. Okay, this is the this is the current jersey, right? That's the current jersey. I think you put this as our. I really, you know what, you know which Calgary jersey I really like. I really like the Calgary jersey where it's like a red background, but the C is black. I'm per, I per, I honestly prefer the C black with the red solid color. I'm not a huge fan of like the where the C is white, the black one. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the the red jersey, but the C is white. I'm not a fan of that one. I guess like. I don't know. The, it's white because it's fire, but no, the the, the the one where the C is black, and then the the, the color is red is much better. It, it pops out more. But the the alternate jersey with the the horse is also really nice. <gasps> oh, I like that jersey too. Calgary does have a nice. Jersey. Yeah, no, they do. I do, and they have. I like the. I like the Calgary. But honestly, I think I prefer Calgary over Edmonton. But Edmonton is the one that made the playoffs. <laughs> it's what it is. Uh, the black jersey is super nice with this. Yeah, yes, the blasty jersey. Fair enough. I did like it at one point. The early two thousands is better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, Kane. Kane got the rock bottom. Boom, baby. Freaking Adler Kane. He used to be a Jets when the Jets first started in 2015. Oh. have better go horn yeah that one i can agree 110 percent i don't i'm not a fan of the i'm actually yeah i'm not a fan of the oiler well I, yeah no the oilers go horn i'm not a fan of it calgary's got a better go horn Adam. <sighs> Adam, they crowned a new woman's champion. Would you like to know? Yes. Can I take a... I'm going to predict. I'm going to guess Alexa Bliss. But let me do a drum roll. Who won? I'm going to do a drum roll. Take a guess. Alexa Bliss. That's my guess. Remember the Washington Capitals old goal horn from all the way back to 2009-ish? Becky, let... Talk about some of the, more of the 
Becky Lynch. I don't think Bliss has come back. Becky Lynch? Wow. So she lost it at WrestleMania and then... No, wait a minute. Really? Rose? Oh, you sent him in, Rose? How, how this siblings eat egg? Oh, no. Damn! Oh, god damn! You see, dude, Rose. Oh, that's pretty smart, Rose. I like how she just slams it. <laughs> slams the egg. Oh, sorry, it's Jerry. I've been missing your memes on Instagram. Okay, what's this one? Burger after burger. Traveled the world together. We've had epic booze ups together. And we have had banger. After banger. After banger. Banger? After banger. After banger. Oh, Emma 10 just scored. Sorry, give me a sec. Fuck Oilers. Yep. Fuck you, Oilers. Fuck you for being good. <laughs> Ravitz McDavid, two now for assists. Yeah, I don't think LA's winning this one. Sheesh. Oh, sheesh. Goddamn, McDavid. McDavid. McDavid needs to take a chill pill. Take a chill pill, McDavid. McDavid needs to chill the freak out. Nah, dude. <laughs> he wants that. He, he deserves a Stanley Cup. Who would you like to go with me on a trip to Colin? Is that a place in Germany? That looks like a German name. Colin. Colin. Is that in Germany? Deutschland. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're fighting. They're getting frustrated. The, uh, the oh, nice. I my prediction was correct. Yeah, that looked like a German word, German name called. Where in Germany is that located? West Germany, East Germany, North South. Um, they got hella restaurants there. Gesundheit. Good. Gut. Good. Ah. Oh. Oh shit. And it, it, oh, that player flew in. Oh, penalty coming for who? That's bullshit if that's an Edmonton penalty. Oh. What? I gotta watch this replay. Ugh. It really looked like the. I'm gonna watch this replay. Nah, okay, fair enough. Fair enough. That That's a fair call. <laughs> Edmonton player just skyrocketed into the goalie like a bowling ball to bowling pins. Never mind, says this. Uh, never, never mind. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. boom. Oh, nice attempt by L.A. Edmonton dumps it down. And, oh, uh, a little L.A. Oh, shit. Three nothing, dude. Jeez. 
LA Kings. Stop shot. Intermission stars four to two. Keens can't score on a team. <laughs> Keens can't score on a team that can't play defense. This could be over in four. Mm -hmm. Yeah. LA shoots it. Saved by Skinner. And now we got a bit of a Royal Rumble. A bit of scrummy scrum in front of the net. Bum, 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 ba uh, I just want to take a moment to really thank you guys if you're still up this late. Again, I hope you guys don't have anything planned early tomorrow. <laughs> um, Cesar, you got school tomorrow? Physics? What time do you got to get up for school tomorrow, Cesar? If I hear that it's 7 o'clock, I'm going to end it after the second period. Power play. For, oh, yeah, they had a power play for about a minute now. LA Kings. Slap shot. Saved by Edmonton. Ooh, Skinner. He skinned that puck as he saves with his glove. Damn, almost breakaway. Oh shit, really? Let's take a look here. Pia Dubois. More fights. Uh oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Why is my stream freezing? This is my first stream, uh, first freeze tonight. Damn it. There we go. Mm -mm. Now my sh now it's starting to freeze up quite a bit. Uh, nothing ever goes how I want. What does that mean, Rose? What do you mean? Are you okay, Rose? Are you okay? What is that? Well, if it's personal or I don't know. How come? Yeah, Rose. Let's talk about it. Hash it out. What does that mean? You're making me, Rose. You're making me worried. Except the Chiefs winning the Super Bowl. <laughs> Yay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Big fight. There, dude. These teams don't like each other, clearly. I want Calgary to make the playoffs. They don't. I want Dallas to win. They don't. I want Edmonton to lose. That doesn't happen. Uh, I'm sorry, Rose. I'm so sorry. Well, you know what? Dallas can still win it. What, what's the score? Let me check the score. Oh, yeah. Dude, Dallas still. Dude, Dallas is actually one of the favorite teams to win the Stanley Cup, if I'm being serious. But let's see the score. Four, dude, dude, look at the Carolina game. Look what happened to the Carolina game. That could happen to the Dallas game. Calgary made some questionable moves. Sorry. Dude, Rose, it is far from over. Even if Dallas loses tonight, dude, so much more hockey. Calgary made some questionable moves. Now they're paying the price. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, Rose. It's far from over. Dallas, even if Dallas loses tonight, I'm really am convinced the Dallas Stars will win their series. They will win the series. They will win. Maybe not tonight. Maybe not tomorrow. Maybe in game six or game seven. But it happens. We all we all go through it. I mean, if I may, uh, you. Sexy Jerry had to go through a heartbreak with his uh, Detroit Red Wings. 
I think that I I, I do I think I, I think sexy Jerry got it the worst. Detroit Red Wings. That's why I'm upset about. Yeah, no, I understand. I understand. But bros, you're not alone. You can ask sexy Jerry, dude. His favorite team was the uh, Red Wings, and they literally missed the playoff by one point. So, dude, I can't, dude. Jerry must have a, the worst. Because in Jerry's situation, there is actually still a chance to make the playoffs, but just by one point, they just had to beat the Montreal Canadiens, and they would have made the playoffs. Yeah, Wien's fans got fucked, and <laughs> we, uh, Wien's fans got fucked in a, a this year, dude. I think Detroit Red Detroit Red Wing fans might have it the worst, just because they literally were a point away, and they had one job. And it was to beat Montreal Canadiens. Montreal Canadiens were terrible this year. Another Oilers power play go. No way. No freaking way. But you know, Rose, you're not alone. That's the that's the sucky thing about sports being a. Oh, that's the thing that sucks about being a sports fan. There's gonna be heartbreaks for sure. There's gonna be great moments, and then there's gonna be heartbreak moments. Oh. Okay, sorry, Rose. This is not going to be a good night, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm sorry. Damn, I don't think LA is winning, guys. I don't, I don't think LA is winning this one. But yeah, dude, we all go through it. I mean, hey, look at on, on Saturday. On Saturday, Toronto lost. I had to deal with the heartbreak. And now tonight, Boston lost. They had to deal with the heartbreak. And then probably game three, Toronto's going to do the heartbreak. You know, it's, I'm sure, dude. I'm mentally prepared. I know the Winnipeg Jets or the Vancouver Canucks are not winning the cup. So there's going to be a point where I'm going to be heartbroken. As a Capitals fan, I went through the worst. Yeah, dude. As a Capitals fan, I went through the worst. Uh, 100% you are going. Sexy Jerry is going through the worst. Vegas, baby. They still strong. 4-2 still. Still 4-2 for them. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'll finish this game since, you know, I don't think LA is going to get five goals in the next period. Years and years of great teams and never winning until 2018 finally. Yeah, definitely. Only wish the Cowboys, dude, or Cesar, his team is the Dallas Cowboys. Dude, you know what I say? Worst comes to worst. It could be worse. You can be a Toronto Maple Leafs fan. They for sure have it the worst. Dude, I'm if people still rock the if people still rock the Leafs jersey, I'm surprised. The last time they won the cup, the Vietnam War was still going on. Let that sink in for a sec. Worst case scenario, yeah, I'll switch to the Dallas game. <laughs> Close game. Is it still 4-2? Maybe I could do that, honestly. You know what? Second intermission. Mmm. 4-2. Do you think Dallas can make a comeback? Do you think they can make a comeback? I think it's possible. LA, please score. <laughs> they, you know what? They may score yet, Rose. They may score yet. No, you changed your picture, Rose. What is that? Oilers suck. Nice. <laughs> I like your picture. It says Oilers suck. Don't worry. If it makes you feel better, Rose, they're not winning the Stanley Cup. If it makes you feel better, Rose, Edmonton is not winning the Stanley Cup 100%. No way they're going to win it. 110%. They're not winning the Stanley Cup. Welp. This game is shit, but good at the same time. <laughs> Marshall Cookie, thank you so much for still sticking around. I wasn't sure if you were gone for the night, but um, 
This game is shit, but good at the same time. Yeah, no, you, I think you said earlier, I think you said earlier that this is one, the one game you're not really interested in, which is, for, oh, good, fair enough. And I'm not sure if you're hoping for LA to win or not, but I guess if you're hoping for LA to win, it's not a good night. Yes, sir, just took a break. Oh, dude, appreciate it. Yeah, appreciate it. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Ooh. But yeah. <laughs> big poop. Big, big poo poo for the LA Kings. Wayne Glensky. Almost 5 nothing. Yeah. I think if Edmonton scores one more time, that's for sure Dunskies. I am not rooting for either of these teams. Fair enough. I just miss Calgary. Um, oh, Rose, I feel you, my friend. I feel your pain. Jeez, these guys are just getting dominated. <laughs> I don't think LA was meant to be in the playoffs. I think they just they kind of got lucky. Uh, they're both stinkers. Uh, yeah, rumors are Dak Prescott may not come back in 2025. Oh shit, really? Oh shit. By the way, yeah. There, Rose, you're not alone. I'm heartbroken the fact that Vegas is winning right now. I'm genuinely... No, I seriously hate Vegas. No, I ah, seriously... Dude, I really don't hate. But if I do hate a team, it is the Vegas Golden Knights. I don't like them. Dude, they beat my Winnipeg Jets twice in the playoffs. It's not fun. If I'm a goalie for LA, I'm letting them have it in the locker room. <laughs> I'm letting them have it in the locker Oh, like you're going to give them shit? I apologize if I'm talking. No, 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 no. It's okay, Rose. Dude, I don't know about... I can't speak for anybody else, but you can trash talk me. Dude, Uncle Stunner does it all the time. Uncle Stunner comes in. Your team sucks. No. I'm personally... I know it's not personal, dude. It's all fun. It's all bragging rights. It's fun. Personally, from me, you're good. You're fine. You don't need to apologize. I can't speak for anybody else, but, dude, you can say Winnipeg sucks, Toronto sucks. Dude, I don't give a shit. Dude, I'm not one of those fans that, like, actually take it seriously. You can say my team sucks. It does little to, you know, I, I'm not one of those fans that get offended over that. To be honest, I am indefinite on Vegas. Uh, Marsha, I agree with you. Both these teams, exactly. Dude, both these teams sucks. Fuck, dude, dude, I'm wearing an Edmonton jersey. I'm wearing an Edmonton jersey. Fuck Edmonton, dude. I'm wearing an, I'm saying fuck Edmonton, and I'm wearing their jersey. It doesn't make sense. Oh, shoot, nice shot for real rolls. If it makes you feel better, these guys are definitely not, they're not winning the Stanley Cup. If that makes you feel better. LOL Rose, it's all good. By the way, you remind me. <laughs> Rose, it's all good. By the way, you remind me of this 49ers fan from the bottom line. Here. Her name is Becca. Defend. Oh, yeah. Oh, Rose! 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 Rose, are you still there, Rose? Are you still there? Don't leave, Rose. Dude, they heard your cries. The LA Kings finally score. Why is that all? There you go, Rose. They heard your cries, Rose. And they answer. I'm, I'm, I'm celebrating the wrong team. I'm doing it just for you, Rose. Just for you. Boom, baby. There you go, Rose. They heard your cries and they answered. Mmm is freaking right. Mmm is freaking right. Let's go. Let's go. 4-1 by the Sasuke Gooner. Uh, it's my sports word in case anybody was wondering. LA just need a little bit of propane. <laughs> I forgot about that. Propane, propane. Gotta stop that game. That's what they do. And you know, you never know. Once now they got the goal, it breaks the ice. Dude, they might get a second goal. A third goal. Dude, Edmonton Oilers is... 
You know, they might be notorious for being those kind of teams. Vegas is going to win. No. See? I don't want Vegas to win. Fuck Vegas. And they're playing in Dallas, too, so that's not good. It's it's kind of scary when, like, um, like when you lose in your own place. You kind of want to win when it's home ice advantage. You don't want to really lose in the home ice advantage game. Say it louder. Fuck Vegas. Fuck Vegas. Say it one more time. Fuck Vegas. And that's what you guys are referring to. I'm not sure. Vegas going and cut. No, they did not. They did not score again. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, phew. Scared me. You freaking scared me, dude. Uh, dude. I'm not, I'm usually not a person that's hate. But if I hate one thing, it's the Vegas Golden Knights. The games are now both 4-2. What? I hope so. I hope so. Rose, are you there, Rose? Dude, I think they heard your cries. Rose, I think they might have heard your cries. Oh! Like that, not 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 quite yet. And a fate pups to that, dude. Has an Edmonton Oilers fan. Time for a stress fape. Time for a stress fape, dude. It's funny. After that second goal, they they pan the cameras to the audience, and all of their faces just like, what the fuck is, dude? They looked scared. Now I think this could be well. Mm, if 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 they get six more LA, just six more, you never know. You never freaking know, my friend. Anything is possible. We have exactly. I was just about to say that Jerry took it out of my mouth. We have a new hockey. Well, maybe not a new hockey game just quite yet, but we got a hockey game. We got a hockey game. For real, bro, make your gonna need to make sure your favorite <laughs> chat. Dude, I'm gonna make sure for tomorrow I switch my coil. Because even tonight, it's starting at, you know, when you, like, I don't know if you guys fape, don't encourage it. But if you're weak like me, hear me out. You know, when you fape, and you know, when it starts to not taste as good, like, it starts to, you know, after a while, like, before you. Before it's time to switch it, you taste that burning a little bit in the coil. I may need to switch my fate before tomorrow's game because I think halfway through, my coil is going to be... For real, bro. Shit's starting to burn. Dude, this is going to sound bad when I'm, when I'm... Dude, if I'm being honest, dude, and I'm not proud to say this, I think after two days, my coil is already done. That's bad. I've been faping a lot lately. I've been stressed a lot lately. I'm not going to lie. But, dude, after two days, my fape coil is already kind of burnt, which is, that's not good. That's chain faping. So, yeah. Dude, I might destroy my coil tomorrow. Because, you know you know what? I'm saying it now. I'm, I'm going to put my bias, my bias aside for a sec. I really do think... Avalanchers, I'm feeling an avalanche win tomorrow. I not, I, I, I'm obviously rooting for the Jets, but I'm also don't want to be a biased fan, and I gotta keep it real. I'm feeling Colorado's gonna win tomorrow. Oh no! Did they take away the goal? Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Wow. 
Wow. Wow. That's racist. That's racism, dude. So why was it a no goal? Oh, high stick. Or... Or it was there's just too much contact of the goalie. There, he couldn't really do much to say. Oh, it bounced off his glove? Can you not? I guess you can't do that. I don't know. Damn. That's bullshit, bro. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Was it maybe because it, it was just in, it was impossible for Skinner to make that save due to the contact? Oh, glove. I Oh, sorry. I missed your comment, uh, Moss Sports World. Thank you. So it, it, it bounced off the glove, and I guess I guess that doesn't count. Like, I know if it goes off a skate, that doesn't count, but I didn't know as well if it goes off a glove. Can't. Oh, okay. You can't uh, handle. Oh, okay. So in case you guys are wondering, Moss Sports World, thank you so much, my friend, for reporting it in. The reason why it was no goal because it was off the glove into the net you can't you can't you can't punch a glove and you cannot punch the you can't punch the puck into the net that doesn't count <laughs> uh skate counts oh skate oh so skates count uh, unless you do an obvious if you do an obvious kicking motion then it doesn't count but if if it generally just deflects off your skate with no intentions to kick it in then it does count oh, okay that's good to know that's good to know. Damn. Now the referees are not showing any mercy to the uh, Hammett, or sorry, the LA Kings. Even they're not showing any mercy. Nah, fuck you, LA. You're not getting this win. <laughs> You're not getting this win. No mercy. Yeah, I'm thinking, guys, I'm going to just finish off the second period and then call it. Yeah, dude, I can't do this for another hour. I got to get up early tomorrow. Ooey, ooey, e. Yeah, it's an e. E. And I'm pretty sure Edmonton's gonna win this, right? I trust the Edmonton always will win this. Set me free. Uh, how? Let me check on the uh, Vegas or not? Yeah, Vegas game. Check the NHL app. I said, it. hey, 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 hey. Four two still. Mm. You know what I may do? All right, this is what I would do. These West Coast games are hard. Yeah. Um, especially if you're like, if you lived in like, if you lived in like Ontario or even worse, uh, like Newfoundland. Hi, how are you? How's it going? Dude, Sheila! Sheila! My friend, my, my tribal chief. Thank you so much, Sheila, for coming up this late. I'm guessing the kids are in bed, so thank you for taking a few moments to come out and say hello. You know what I'm going to do, guys? Once th once this game goes into intermission, I'm gonna finish off the Dallas game. I'll switch the scoreboard and everything. I'll switch it up for you guys. Then at least finish the night with the Dallas Stars. How's that? Because Sheila's in here now, and I know she's a Dallas Stars fan. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I mean, I don't know. The Islanders are up. Yeah, exactly. Okay, good idea. Sounds good. We're gonna do it. Cause yeah, I'm. Not, I don't know if I could go up for another hour <laughs> by the time this game goes into intermission there will probably be like less than 10 minutes left in the Vegas game finish it up do it for you I'm gonna do it for you Rose and then I'll do it for Sheila I don't know if we plan to stay here too long but yeah I, I do because this Edmonton game will probably go past midnight but at least I got through most of this game I got through the first two periods that's the majority of it and yeah, I think we if it was a close game, like tied game, I say fuck it, I'm going in. But since we have a score like this, I think it's almost safe bet to say Edmonton's gonna win. Unless they start sucking. I'm watching for Dallas game, bad game so far. Mm. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna switch it. Sheila's watching it. 
Let's switch it up. I think Edmonton should win. Should be a safe bet. I'm going to wake up tomorrow and see LA wins in overtime. <laughs> but let's switch it up. Uh, Vegas and Dallas Stars. Let's switch it up a Ruli. And then I shall... I got to do... Let me do a few things here. Let's finish the knife. Just, just for you, Rose, because I know you're not happy right now. So I'll do it just for you. I gotta do a few things, so I gotta get the link. Uh, I gotta do a few things still here. Schedule or scores. Uh, shit. I said a a a a. Okay, so game cast. Copy the link. And I'm going to switch that up. Switch that up. Dallas is outplaying them. They can't get a bounce. Hmm. Marchman across the line. Marchman, wrist shot, blocker save. Got it to the far corner by Thompson. All right, it's gonna take a second to load all this graphic arts team. I don't know, man. We saw that happen for the Jets. Up, big ups to the Pegger Adam Jets game. Should it's gonna be a good one. It's gonna be a stressful one. I think Avalanche's are gonna to win tomorrow. I hope I'm wrong. I seriously hope I'm wrong, but I'm feeling uh, Avalanche's win tomorrow. But I hope I'm wrong. So, uh, stars. I gotta get the. Let me just get the team logos real quickly. Oh, uh, shit. Mm, I gotta do a few things here. I said, hey. Oh. I'm gonna miss a goal. Probably by the time I get this. Alright, here we go. Uh, Dallas Stars logo. Where is it? Where the fuck is it? There it is. Mm, and they're facing who? Vegas. <laughs> Vegas. I puke, dude, in my mouth a little bit. Vegas. There we are. Come on. All right. Let's see if this, if I did this right. Oh, sorry guys, I'm almost done. Just getting the logos here for you guys. I'm so tired. I am too. I'm struggling. But we're gonna finish this game. We'll at least finish this game. How's that? Edmonton could probably call Jack Campbell and win still. <laughs> it's that bad. Let's go, Stars. Okay, let me take my Edmonton jersey off. I'm going to take it off. BRB. I'm just going to step aside. It's easy to bundle your home and car. It's easy to get up. Stay up. No sleepies. Chipotle's chicken al pastor is back. And it's fire on every level. Fresh home. chicken, hot off the grill. Mixed with marita peppers, a splash of pineapple, and fresh lime. It's where fire meets flavor. Chipotle's right. chicken al pastor. The wait is over. At East, your backyard is right in your backyard. So when you need to feed your grass, remove the weeds or wrangle those leaves. Go to the best place that delivers on top brands like Ego, Toro, Steel, and Scott's. No warehouse store can match the convenience of your neighbor Ace. So stop on by. Is it coming? Is it coming? Alrighty. Alrighty. No, put on Calgary jersey for backup. Now you have to change the jersey. I got the SOS jersey. Woo! I got the SOS jersey. Put on the Jets. Ooh, Marshall saying Jets jersey. Rose is saying Calgary jersey. You know what I was thinking? I was thinking of being neutral. This and just keep the SOS just to be safe. Hmm. I think that's a safe bet, no?
bet. Got the SOS jersey. Just so I'm, new, I'm on neutral grounds. I don't, I don't upset anybody of what jersey I put on. Now four two finally. All right. Less than ten minutes left. Hey, read Jerry's comment. Sorry. Uh, Jerry said, "Paint a Dallas star on your shirt." <laughs> Oh my god. You don't wanna see you don't wanna see that Dude, it's gross. I look like a freaking gorilla. Man, look at the shots on goal. Dallas Stars has twenty-three shots on that. Vegas fourteen shots. Damn man. Disgusting. Dallas should be yeah, Dallas has Dallas has more shots on that and then they're still losing. Hey, Let's not forget about that uh, Hurricanes game. If they could do it, so can Dallas. Dallas is cooked. I think so. Croissant. I can't unsee. Yeah. That's why I said, I don't know if you want me to paint a star on my chest, because then you have to see that. You know what I mean? So, I don't know. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think it'd be funny, but then you have to see that man chest. I don't think you want to see that. Mm. Oh, I, damn it. I don't have the goal horns. Damn it. Do I have the Dallas goal horn on my computer? <laughs> oh, yes, I do. Yes. N no, I don't. Archer saw in the corner. Sagan. You know what? We can end it on a good night. We can end it on a good night. I can't get that out of my head now. Oh, you said read Jerry's comment. You know, if I paint a star on my chest, it requires to see that, right? That's why I'm like, oh! Damn, he should have saved that. Boo hoo, Fagus Knights. Dallas, stars, Dallas, stars, Dallas. Stars. Oh, this game is not over yet, my friends. This game is not over yet. Not even close. Power play Edmonton? Yeah, Edmonton's going to win. 100%. Dallas. Stars. Dallas. Stars. Shoot again. And you know what? That breaks the ice. So now Dallas Stars are going to really oomph, bring in the oomph. Vegas, though. Shoots it. Oh. Dead Mutton. <laughs> oh, no. Not Dead Mutton. Not Dead Mutton. Not Dead Mutton. LA just scored. Woo! Did they seriously did? Oh, yeah, no. I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna finish Edmonton game. So I figured we'll at least finish this game off. Now my stream is clickbait because <laughs> it says Edmonton versus LA, but then it's. No, nah, I don't care to be honest. It is. Make some noise. Under seven minutes to go. A one goal game now. Mantha tucks to the corner. Centering pass by Carlson, deflected by Haskin and into the netting and out of play. Cut the lead to two. Six forty six to go in the third. Mason Marchman. One on three. Damn. Yeah. You should have saved that, but I guess not. This week only, large two-topping pizzas at Domino's. I have fit in there. Dallas, stars, Dallas, stars. 
Hmm. Let's go. Let's freaking go. That happened like minutes ago. You need Ron. Ron needs a retirement plan. Work with principles so we can help you with a plan. This is Litter Robot, the highest rated self cleaning litter box that removes the chore of scooping and helps you have a cleaner home. After your cat exits, Litter Robot. Yeah, dude, tomorrow's going to be a fun stream. Jets and uh, Avalanche. It's a little bit later, though, 8 30. Kind of a weird time for a Winnipeg. Winnipeg's games are normally 7 p.m., but for some reason, I don't know why. Do you? Do we not? I don't like Vegas. I don't know about you guys, but no, I don't like Vegas. No. Which NH Which NH Which NHL theme do you like the best? Honestly, bro. Dallas. Like, are you talking about the Go Horn? Dallas Stars has probably got one of the best ones. Dallas Stars. Dallas Stars. Dallas Stars. Dallas. I think Dallas Stars might have one of the best. Um, the network intro. Nice. Nice. This is a. Wait a minute. They're playing in Dallas, right? That's a, you know what? They're playing in Dallas, which is central time. So this is going to be a late game for these people. Like, they got to get up for work tomorrow. That's They're going to be tired for work tomorrow, these people. They're going to be super tired for work. But then again, Winnipeg's game is in Winnipeg tomorrow at 8.30. So you won't really be getting home until midnight if you're going to the Jets game tomorrow. Ely, TSN Sportsnet, Monday on. Mm. Race for the puck. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Dallas, 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 backhand. Dallas. He... Oh no. Oh no. Two on one. Two on one. Vegas. Nice defense. Nice defense. Nice defense. Stop shot. Missed the net. Dallas racing for the puck. Another hit. And now Keegan Colasar escapes. And makes no mistake, gets it deep. Makes no mistake, gets it deep. Lobbed out. Dodonoff with a reach. Taken off his stick by Braden McNabb. It bounces into the right of Ottinger. Hasten it and carry a meet. Chopped over the glass and mm. out of play by Wyatt Johnston. Oh. With 5-11 to go in the third period. Game one. A one goal game. Down uh, the stretch. Ooh, commercial break. Eh. Hey, Juice. What are your financial goals? No goals. What's your financial Ready goals? For retirement? No goals. Good talk. See you on the ice. Oh, send me something? No goals. Talk to a financial professional today. Nice meet you. You send me something? This is Zoom. Oh, cool, Rose. Is that the moon? It zoomed in. Is that a, is that a uh, is that your microscope, Rose, of the moon? The Lexus take on luxury. Very nice. Wherever you go, live up. Very nice. The all new GX. Oh, itchy spot. Here at Once Upon a Farm, we chose the Capital One Venture X business card. With no preset spending limit, our purchasing power adapts to meet our business needs. And unlimited double miles means we earn more too. What's in your wallet? What's in your wallet? Hurry up, agent. Only 20 seconds left. Uh-huh. But which one Fuck. should I cut? The <laughs> red or the blue or the... Well, it's usually but there is also might get ESPN and TNT back. Ooh, let's go. This is a great game. This one here. You know what? It's been a great night for hockey. 
Uh, Boston versus Toronto game was good. Um, especially if you're a Leafs fan. I mean, I, you know, I guess depending if you, depending on the team you root for. Like, if you're an L.A. fan tonight, it might not be a great night, <laughs> obviously. But, um, L.A. and Edmonton, 4-2. They could come back from that game. Dude, if I wake up tomorrow to see L.A. came back in a 1, I'm going to laugh. I'm going to laugh my way to work tomorrow. <laughs> I think the Stanley going back to Canada. Mm, my heart's been broken too many times. Dude, as long as Gary Bettman is the commissioner of NHL, it ain't gonna happen. It ain't gonna happen. Nope. Dude, it's a rig sport. Guys, you know, you, hockey is a rig sport. Just like the NBA, MLB, all those sports are rigged. But, if it does happen, at least uh, I could die happy. Uh, less than three and a half minutes. Dallas needs to get a goal if they want to force an overtime. Oh, yeah. The shitty thing about overtime in the playoffs is there's still an intermission, which is kind of shitty. And we got to wait the 15 minutes. Dallas. Oh, my. Saves. Shoot it. Saved by the goalie. And Petrangelo was there. Carlson clears the zone. Under four minutes to go. Mantha centering. <gasps> oh, holy fucking shit! Damn, they almost scored. Howden had a point blank look. That wrister gets to the high glass behind as Mantha set him up. Ottinger keeps the stars alive. A pivot. Duchesne rinkwide to Harley. A massive save from Ottinger to keep this a one goal game. Stars tie this up. That's going to go down as a big Two and, and a half minutes. Oh, oh no. Oh, misses the net. Man, Dallas deserves to win this. They are holding together. Uh, two and a half minutes left. They're going to probably pull their goalie soon. And like I said, I'm rooting for Dallas. To the loose puck. It's blocked again by McNabb in front of the net. He's tied up in a battle, but still push, stuck his leg out and blocked that. Good shot game, through. yeah. I mean, I obviously missed the first two periods, but I imagine this was a good game. Of a score like this, it was probably a very good game. Wyatt Johnston across to Tanev. Jets tomorrow. Mm, that's, you know, it's gonna, tomorrow's going to be a party. Ben wrist shot gobbled up by Thompson. And if, if Jets win tomorrow, I'm going to be a happy camper. But I said it, and I'll say it again. I think Avalanches are going to win tomorrow. I really do feel it. This is my inner my inner side of me is telling me that uh, uh, they're going to win. Andrew stays with him, fights it off with his left shoulder. Good opportunity for Howden. If the Jets win the Cup, Adams, <laughs> dude, I don't know if you know this, Jerry. I might have said that before in my streams when you were here, but I've never been drunk in my life. I've never been drunk in my life. Never. I may have been buzzed, but I've never been drunk. If Jets win the Stanley Cup, it might be my first time being drunk, just saying. Yeah, that's why I said it. <laughs> I'm getting drunk with Team SOS. Oh, no. Bowen's taking... Dude. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know. If they go to the Stanley Cup, I may have to go to the party. I don't know. I may have to go to the whiteout party on the street there. It's going to be a riot in Winnipeg. It's going to be a freaking riot. He does such a good job in front of the net, making his stick presentable, looking for tips. And as they work this puck around, it's going to be Robertson who gets it. Pavelski prevent, per, presents his stick right there. Good tip, good save from Logan Thompson. Petrangelo there. Tries to come out and block that. 
Uh, bonus taking LST if we win. They will. There will be blood. Oh yeah, I can see Winnipeg being a riot city. Hell yeah. All right, dude. Less than almost almost a minute left. They uh, have they put out the goal yet? Overtime. Oh god. I hope not. <laughs> I want Dallas to win, but at the same time, I don't want an overtime. Dallas shoots it. The Coley is out. The Coley is out. Oh boy. Oh geez. Oh geez. Dallas Stars in the Vegas zone. Shoots it. That is out of the play. Whistle blown. Rethink your lives. Do it again. I fell asleep. No, I understand, Rose. I understand. If you felt, you guys, it's seriously, thank you so much if you're still up. Just so you know, you don't have to be up this late if you got something going on tomorrow morning. But this should be almost over soon. Unless Dallas scores and we got to go to overtime. Oh, boy. No, you know what? If they go to overtime, mm, that's a... Nah, I still might call it. What is the responsibilities? Where we're going? What are the assignments? And on a wind draw, we pump it behind the net. Are we continuing to go up the strong side? But yeah, I know it is late. It is super late. Cesar, I hope you don't have to get up too, too early. 10 o'clock over here. Oh, yeah, you're mountain time. Do you see, imagine being, imagine if you lived in the, in the East Coast and you had to stay up this late for a game. It's got to suck because it's, it's midnight now over there in Easter. If you lived in Newfoundland or Halifax, I think, it's even worse. It's 1 o'clock over there. Hope this game goes to OT. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Empty net. All right. DD, you from Alberta? That's a good question. Uh oh. Misses the net. Icing call for Dallas Stars. Lots of. Uh, that clock stopped a bit early. That was weird. Mm, I told you. It's a rig sport. A rig sport. Oh, you're from Alta? Oh, shit. No way. How did he? DD. It must be. How does it feel? How does it feel that you guys are getting a hockey team next season? Please. Cesar says, please. Cesar. This is scary times. Scary times right now. Your team. Same setup for Dallas here. Robinson's gonna try to come in and grab this. Man, 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 man. Robertson chips it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Misses the net. Another icing call. Jeez. They're dragging this out. Dallas now, maybe you take that time out, try to draw something up. Looks like they're not going to, though. Jamie Ben locks in. Try to win this draw. Michaels won the last couple on this side. He's won 11 of 18 tonight. Mm. All right, face off. Here we go. Take four, three. Pretty pump. Pretty, pretty, pretty pump. Start. Oh man, false start. This time Ben wins it. Wins the fit. Oh. It eluded Haskinen. No icing call. I know a friend that's from. Oh, that's cool. You know a friend from Newfoundland, hey? Yeah, they they would be like. Uh, uh you're it. They're like three hours ahead of you. We're going to be shitters next year, though. Mm, there you go. No, yeah, I don't know. I mean, oh, Jerry's yelling the F word. Fuck. Is that, is that it? Is that it? Did they not win? Mm, oh, yeah, that just updated. That tells me the game just ended. Oh, man. 
Oh man. Yeah, I see it. All right. I was gonna close it off. Did not gonna win. All right. All right. All right. No overtime. No. Damn it, we gonna have to end the night on a sad note. I call shenanigans. Gonna have to end the night on a sad note. I call shenanigans. Uh, see what I... T yeah, I know, Rose. Rose, you're not alone. We all... I think everybody in here was rooting for Dallas Stars, so... You're not alone, my friend. Okay, time to get ready to floss with my hair. Oh, you gotta go... Ah. <laughs> uh, 23 folds uh, won't do that. Yeah, let's. I gotta call it. But we'll be back tomorrow. Winnipeg Jets, Avalanches, game two. I'm gonna be super pumped for that one. Good night. Again, if you're still up this late, God bless. Love you all. Means the world. Means the. Seriously, means the freaking world. And I really hope your tomorrow morning's not tough because of me. But let's call it. Obviously, I'm not finishing the Edmonton game. So let's do the credits. So, go Avs. All right, Rose is going for the Avs. Obviously, I'm going to be Team Jets. Uh, good night from the Cesar. Good night, Marshall. Good night, Rose. Good night, Moss Sports World. Uh, Didi. Sexy Jerry. Sexy Jerry. Good night. And obviously, good night to anybody else that was here earlier. Love you all. Stay safe. Be safe in case I don't see you tomorrow. Have a go, oh, John Jansen. I almost got you. Have a good night. If I don't see you in the next one, have a good morning, afternoon, evening, and night, babe. <laughs>